Welcome back, sports fans, disc golf fans alike. Uh, hole three of Brad versus the Bruiser. Kind of been working on my move the last couple days. Threw a couple of practice shots. I'm hoping to make a better score today. But this is one heck of a beast. If I don't get off the tee, it's Katie bar the door. Number six here in uh, Clearwater, Minnesota. 695 feet. Uh, big dog leg right. You got to get down there a fair amount of the way off the tee or you're in big trouble. Okay, so Brad's here versus the Bruiser. Preserve championship. This one averages at about a five, which is definitely the hardest hole on the course. I've talked to a few people, especially the course designer, Kayla Visca, and it sounds like the line for Brad is over under six. So in the comments, leave what you think he's gonna take. And then uh, right now, go to there right now. And here we go, he's ready. All right, Brad, see you, babe. little left side so how'd that go oh, where'd you go it went a little left side looks like a big bowl of weak sauce i didn't throw it very good <laughs> bowl. huge bowl of weak sauce i'm probably in a tough spot might not be able to get much on it but i figured five at worst five at worst oh i, but like I was really looking for a par so uh i might get crazy here and try something stupid see what kind of lie we get up here all right we found the lie he was right not that great not that great of a lie I should probably get my card out of the way. Not very good with side arms, but that's pretty much all I got here. If I want to try to get up there for any shot at a four. All right, here we go. It's going with the side arm. Ooh. Oh, of course I overcook it. Yeah. <laughs> great. Just great. Looking like another 12 coming up. Do you think there's more pressure for one whole challenge than like an actual round? Or is this just like no, no, no just, pressure at all and just kind of a little no, rusty? Just, my game is weak sauce and uh, I threw weak sauce and then I tried to get up here for a chance at the four and probably should have taken something more stable, but I was trying to get some D and I flipped it over. Okay. So now it's in a nightmare spot. Yeah, great. <laughs> oh man, not the best spot. Not the best, it's the absolute worst. Worst spot ever. I mean, I think we just maybe pitch out to still, there. No, I gotta get something on it. Where are you going? Should I come out here and video? I mean, whatever you want to do. Come on. Well, tell me where you're trying to go. I'm just gonna chip something out here. I'm gonna kill myself. Couldn't play much worse, Brad. So, known Brad a long time. Here's the thing. One of the most competitive athletes I've ever met in my life. This is killing him. I'm telling you guys, his game's way better than this. But the bruisers are tough out here. They're not that easy. Yeah, if you throw them where I they're not. They're not that easy. But I think he has a chance to get up and down from here. One, two... Three, four, neato. What a shot. What an absolute beauty. Yeah, I should have thrown the stable, boy. It's probably short. Three, four, this is for a five. Now this is for a six. Six ball, you got this. Let's go, Brad, what a putt. <laughs> that was nasty. Yeah, great six. <laughs> Wee! Wee! I made a double, yeah. <laughs> Let's 
look at this stroke. Dude, I'm five over. I know, but you're playing the hardest courses in the world. Look it at this. Doesn't matter. It's he goes through stroke. the little tiny gap. That was nasty, dude. Yeah. We'll replay that in slow motion. Brad versus the Bruiser, hole three. Tough. Tough out here, dude.